look at that beautiful trailer full of bales. Oh, what happened there? Why don't why aren't you going on? There you go. Uh, and L. No, because my keyboard has completely quit. What is that all about? There we go. Oh, for goodness sakes. Do you know what? I might just give up doing this. <laughs> I think I've had enough. Has Seba had enough? Possibly. Possibly Seba has had enough. Who knows? So we'll go around here, we'll grab the rest of these bales in this field. Which is going to be a lot. This this trailer is going to be too heavy to tow with another trailer. As I was saying in the last episode, I thought maybe we could tow both trailers together. I don't think that's going to happen. So I have to do one at a time. Possibly stick a tractor on. Follow me. The old loaderino is not happy about it and to be fair we won't get all those bells on there anyway will we two four six eight oh actually we, we will with a little bit of squeezing in here and there come on Kramer I think there is as good a spot as any Just jump out. One, two, you, and you, and you. Because we're going to have to slide that bad boy out the way. So I will get these other ones in. What is a lat field there? Is that right? No, that's not. Is it? What is that in there? It's a different texture altogether. It is rape, isn't it? Oh no! Sorghum! Uh. Let me over. Stupid. Lovely jubbly, let's put these on then. So that was um, painful. <laughs> it's not painful at all. We've got three bales left there. We've got a really... I don't know whether it's going to take four on the top here. But we're going to... Three, I mean, not four. Let's try it, though. And let's try all of them at once, I guess. Um, and then we'll go sell them. I don't know what tractor is going to be the right one to try and drag this lot along with. Probably, probably the Ford, I guess. Or the, no, the Massey's on the corn car. It's okay. We'll use the Ford. This is only going to go up the road, isn't it, actually? Oh, I wonder whether Kramer can do this. Well, it's going to be a long, slow procedure. I keep thinking that we've got to go all the way down 
to the um, to the shore side, down to the town, but we don't. We've just only got to go over to the BGA with these, haven't we? Because there is nowhere else to sell bales. This is going to be exciting. So yeah, those uh, those Hestons won't go. Won't fit. Probably because I've got like a foot gap between those two at the front, but. There's no more space at the wall pallet. Thing in me job flim flam. Again? We're full up again? Right, team. This is gonna be fun and slow and You can do it! You can get us there. <laughs> Perhaps. Don't fall over and that'll be just stupid, will it? Not too fast, Seeber. So let's let's have those bets put in. Is it going to fall over whilst we go there? Will we make it unscathed? Yes, I think we will, unless some stupid motorist hits us. I've seen worse go down the road. <laughs> That's true. It's very true. Yeah. Hestons aren't the they're not the right bale to use because they don't work with anything. Unless you use the the stuff that the Heston has been designed to work with or the trailers that have been designed to work with the Hestons. They just don't work with anything, you know? So it's just pointless. We just it looks grand. The co the um, combine the baler looks grand, but in all seriousness, it's the right pain in the foo foo, isn't it? It's a right pain. Oh, beautiful! Do you know what? I have a chainsaw. Do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to chainsaw it down. Yes, I am. Oh. Where is it? There it is. There we go. I think that will do nicely. Arrivederci, <laughs> tree. No more. That's not happening. We'll go around them. To be fair, it would have just snapped off that branch. Well, that was fun. That's today's excitement done with, you see. Oh, he's a low one. <laughs> Nearly there. Oh. There we go. Splendid bit of driving there by Seabra. We're never going to get up here though, we may have to fetch the old Volvo. Oh, come on. <sighs> we can do it. We can get up there. Can we? Can we get up there? I don't know. There we go. Hopefully, I don't need to unload this. It will just do it itself. Uh, but if not, it's okay, because we have the loader here to do such a thing. Come on, Oak. 
Kramer. I don't know why you're being so silly. I mean, I know it's heavy, but still. You're not that pathetic, are you? And... Sod in typical. <laughs> side I think we'll just push it off what do you reckon team do you reckon they'll all go if I just push it don't, don't punch any tires Only one. Only one didn't want to play with that. We've nearly got a million. We're not far off of it. I'm gonna go with we'll have a million. In no time at all. So we've got 857,482. Um uh, we've still got a load of silage that needs to go. So we will go and. Is it still go? Oh, it's nearly empty. Let's let's get another load in there then. It won't be long. Nope. Why are you doing that? I don't know why it does that. Is that? Watch. It's going to dump a load, but it doesn't actually. See? What's that all about? <laughs> it's just... It's just terribly annoying. That's what it is. Leave you there. We'll get the loader back with the trailer and then we'll take the Massey and dump its boats. Here we are. I'm going to... Uh, no, we'll stick it around the corner. I was going to just dump that off there. In typical don't care fashion. And I do care. There is something odd going on with this trailer and the Kramer. It's as if it's got the brakes locked on. I don't have auto attach, so it's not like I've missed off the um, bits and pieces, so I'm not quite sure. It's not the greatest trailer in the world though, is it, to be fair? We want that on there so that we can just quickly move a couple of pallets because we are full up again impressive as it is team sheepy sheepy 
<laughs> it's not overly helpful. Why don't you just run through my loader? That was weird. Let's see if we can do it two at a time again. No, it doesn't look like. Oh! Yes, it does. I'm going to have a look and see if I can get those extended forks for doing exactly this. Because, uh. This seems clever. <laughs> I feel like we could get three. three pallets abreast on the trailer if we could get them to go on nice and tight, you know? I feel like we could possibly get three across on that. Unlikely. Nothing ever goes quite according to plan, does it? Oh, that was serious, wasn't it? Right, pick that up rather weirdly. If that's the case, we'll go with it. I don't quite think that's exactly what I wanted from it. There we go. Well, let's take the Massey and sell some oats. Actually, before we do that, let's just double check. The oats. Coastal exports grain. It's still the highest price. So it is up here still. For now, I guess we could wait until the price is higher elsewhere, but nah. Should go in on board. Come on, girl, you can do this. This is nothing for you, really. It's not even a full load. To be fair, that's still quite a lot, isn't it? <laughs> it's just, uh, yeah. Yeah, still a lot. Right. Just coming out, people. There we go. <laughs> Got no choices over the matter. Here cometh the Massey. I love it. I love it in here. It's great. Oh, come on, girl. Steady as she goes. Here we go. So we're not doing it in the cell everything, we're doing it in the coastal exports, and that is this one just here, that's right. Because that is actually got a higher price than the cell everything one. Is that it? Twenty-two thousand eight hundred and seventy-four. What an absolute stonking price folks. Well, that will conclude today's episode of 
Farming. Thanks for watching everyone. Stay safe and may the weather be with you.